Wow. This this view is beautiful. Seeing this entire town on top of this, this little tower. It's so nice. Well, off to the world map. Hello, everybody. This is Dragon Kirby, and welcome back to Kirby of the Forgotten Land. In the last episode, we explored a little bit, a couple of the stages of the Winter Horns, and we decided to go fishing. Now, let's go to the windy, freezing seas, and let's see what, uh, what levels has, what this level has for us for, uh, collecting Waddle Dees. See, it seems to be windy, but I don't want this. I want, give it, give me my needle. I want to roll around. Whee! You can collect that. Aha, take that fire. Let's ignore the bull or buffalo. Technically, whatever that's supposed to be. Ooh, rice ball. Let's see a rice ball. And if we go over here, we have ourselves a pipe mouth. Gotta keep on rolling, gotta keep on rolling, rolling! There's a cutter, cut, cut out, not cutter, a needle ability capsule right here, plus some model D's. But if we go all the way over here, we found a cave that's safe from the wind. <gasps> it's little sleepy babies. Little sleepy babies. What's the uh, what's up with these guys? Little sleepy babies. They're so cute. I'm gonna let them live. I'm gonna leave them alone. Sleepy babies stay safe. Kirby games are too cute. What's over here? A ability capsule. Nice. Eh. Clutter everywhere. I will litter the waters. Let's roll around, roll around. Come on. Oh. This is weird looking. <laughs> that was weird looking. Oh. Into the frozen water I go. Nothing over here. Let's grab our ring mouth and let's go in. <laughs> Power of hoof. Enjoy three meals at sea, which is one of our many, our many objectives. Oh, it is a meal at sea. But, boop. Boop. I like just going, bloop. Whatever, I do, do little air puffs. Bloop. Oh, hey, look, this Garfi has a meal at sea. And now that we've got all three delicious meals at sea, we can grab ourselves our second Waddle D, and we can head out. Air puff, air puff. Let's eat that, and let's climb. You gotta come with me, fire. D never mind. I guess not. <laughs> Needle is such is such a weird ability, but so fun. I want to need fire. Luckily, there's a fire ability right here. Ah. And light the torch. Ow. Thank you. And we can grab our third Waddle Dee right here. Wait, what? D okay.
Okay, I'm I am dashing back instantly. I am going to look around. There's because if I missed a waddle D, it's somewhere near it has to be in here, right? There's no way I missed it in the uh no way I missed it in the in, in the room before, right? Please don't tell me I actually missed one in the room before. I actually did. Dang it! I th I thought I found I thought I, was, I kept track of everything. That's upsetting. What's in here? We have dragon fire. That's gonna be nice to have, at least. Let's drop a fire, drop a fire ability just to get a new one. Light a torch. And drop right here. Oh, jump into the secret underground room. Nice. Well, at least it at least it gives us what our what our challenge is really easily. Come on, that'd be quick. Why? Into the cannon. Woo, okay, we got it. First try, baby. I can't believe we actually missed a Waddle Dee. I'm upset. Let's burn these boys. Or girls. Whatever they are. Let's get all the way here. Take, get our another little figurine. There we go. I will say, at least I only missed a hidden Model D and not having to look for, you know, one of the hidden missions. Actually, I don't even know if that's better or not. We got an invincibility candy. A Sir Kibble. Nice. Oh, that level. Battle of Blizzard Bridge. That's gonna be fun. We have one. We have two more hidden uh, treasure rows. But I gotta go find a hidden model D. Let's see where it is. Oh. So that's where it was. There's a little area that was sparkly. Right around the corner, you would use fire, and there it is. Okay, well, I'll see you all uh, when we're done with the level. What do we get for a figurine? We get Cluttered Needle. Pointy, spiky cut clutter rolled up into a ball. It's, ne it's needles upon needles. What a powerful weapon. Roll forward, then release to send sharp clutter flying around you. Ouch. Ouch. Well, that takes care of that. Oh, Waddle Dee saved. Woo. Now it's time for this. Battle of Blizzard Bridge. I will upgrade our little... We will upgrade our fire at the very end of the level, don't worry. I feel like it's better than just constantly going back and forth from Waddle Dee Town in between each level we get a scroll. But first, before we do anything, before we even go to the bridge, we need to go all the way over here. Two reasons. One, 
we have a mushroom where we have to take a detour to get one then if we we can climb all the way up here to get a green a green star coin then we can go over here to a bridge to a ladder i mean yeah. then if if we go all the way over here we have a little figurine and a chest full of money. There's a window open. What happens when we walk into the window? We have a little secret area. With a, with a, with a uh, warp star. What does the warp star do? It takes us to the upper level of the bridge. Where we fight two bosses. Now this is gonna be fun. I thought that was dead. That I thought he was done. Let's just turn him on fire. Have the have the fire take him out. Eat the sword. And we'll have Mennonite Sword take him out. One, two, three. And if we go over here, we have a little secret zone. Okay, okay we gotta cut the cone properly. Perfect. I almost had it right. Bam! There we go. We can... At least we get a carrot to, uh, to reheal the health we got. And now we can save a Waddle Dee. We've basically now entered hard mode. Where every single, uh... Boss fight... Because we are going to, like, a mini... Mini boss rush. Where we get to go in between each little area and face off against a boss. Well, duh, but instead of one, it's two. Like here, Twin Florina. I want to use the blade beam to my advantage here. Ooh. Oh. There we go. I, was, I got quiet there because I wanted to stay safe there. Blade beams. Go. Activate. No! Ah, it's so all close to doing it without taking damage. Let's drop ability. Let's grab our tornado. And we can enter into here. Let's just a tornado ability. Let's grab here. Are you. That worked out well. Let's try this again. Jump. Jump. Nope. Ah. Uh, this is... This is a bit trickier than I thought. Than I remembered. I, are you kidding me? Okay, let's eat the soda. Let's be safe. And take the soda machine. Jump, jump. And there we go. We'll take the so we'll take the hidden waddle D. That we're fine. 
Oh good, there's a safe path all the way here. Eh. Let's get out of here. Let's drop the ability and let's head forward. It seems like we have drill. Oh, I guess I'll take it. We have twin wild bonkers. Come on. I'm gonna do this. No, 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 no. I don't want this. I'm gonna use. I'm just gonna use basic Kirby here. Make it easier for me. So I can grab hammer. Come on. Come on. Fight! Fight! And bang! Take that. I did. That was a bit trickier than it should have been. Anything? Anything? Nope. Okay, let's go. Hit the little stud, and we have a time limit. Oh my goodness, I forgot. I just, I realized it missed something. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Yep, I'm not gonna make it. I'm gonna have to restart this entire section. And I completely forgot to grab something. I forgot to grab the poster from the tornado section. I can't go back to it either. Uh, at least I can grab the hidden waddle D here. I can just grab the wanted poster in the tornado section. No, oh, I jumped. Come on, let's be quick. Come on, come on, there we go. Woo! We made it. Okay. We made it. Ooh, what's this? What's this? This. Ooh, I unlocked something. Wait. Did I unlock the. Okay. That was weird. Over here we have one wild frosty. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna take it. Careful here. And there we go. Oh, and now we have two. Oh, and I already failed the challenge. Because there's a challenge where I have to fight the Frosty without taking damage, and I've already failed. But I will at least, I will at least do this. Keep going. Come on, fire. 
the team's on. Ooh, that dodge roll is is being a uh, a saving grace for us here. Let's grab ice. Hey. Ooh, what's in here? We get the frosty ice blueprint. You can now evolve the ice ability. Take it to Waddle Dee's weapon shop. Well, let's see what's inside the regular, uh... Let's see what's in here. Oh! I see what this is. This is. We have to, like, slide her around. And... We have to... We have to time our... Oh, that is a tiny platform. Okay, there's a snow cone right there. Or ice cube. Ice cream right there. We can at least get an extra chance. Do I take this? No! I was too early that time. Dang it. Let's, uh, smack it. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Jump. I, pr I was spamming A. I probably shouldn't have been spamming A. I should have been, like, actually timing it. Okay, come on, come on. Come on, quickly, quickly, come on. Oh my gosh, I actually made it. I'll just show you where that poster is. Just right there. And I'll you We'll have to try to show you what the poster looks like, where the poster location is in the tornado section once we return to this level. This level was a lot more uh, stre strenuous than I thought. Maybe because I chose the hard mode of this level, not the easy mode. What did I get for doing all this? A ton of money and food! And a, and a capsule. I did not think this was worth it. But hey, I'll take the money, at least. Let's get going! <laughs> Beat twin, beat twin wild frosty without getting hit. It's because uh, we went through the hard mode. The one that we fought without taking damage, the the singular frosty doesn't count. Luckily, I'm going to go for the easy mode one, the like the normal route. So that way, it'll be much easier for me. Car mouth Kirby. Kirby gained the mysterious mouthful mode ability after he flew into that vortex. Now he, he can stuff an entire car into his mouth. When he does, he turns into a peppy pink car that can jump and use turbo dash. It's a nice day for a scenic drive. Turn up the radio. The Alival Mall sign. This was the logo for Alival Mall, owned by Alival Holding Company, making life even livelier. Uh, was their corporate slogan. They ran a wide range of businesses, entertainment arenas, food shops, service industries. Now the remains of the biz those businesses can be found in all kinds of places, empty and alone. We have Chain Bomb. Chain your bombs together to explode all, all of them at once. Hold down the button and aim and throw, the, throw, to, throw to place them. The more bombs you connect, the more damage they'll do. And off we go. We missed two. No, three. Dang it. I missed three. Waddle, 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 waddle. And... The Unexpected Beast King. Oh yeah! The Waddle Dees helped you open the gate that was blocking your way. Head into the state. 
Head into the stage and challenge the boss that's guarding this territory. There we go. I can read totally. Well, I'm gonna after. Well, I would do a couple of treasure roads, but first let's go. Yes. Okay. Thank you for telling me that there's a uh, there's a poster, not a poster. There's a building prepared in uh, Waddle Dee Town, Ethelin. But right now we have bosses to fight. I'll see you all when we get to the poster. And at you. Uh, there we go. I don't know why I couldn't just get up there, but there we go. There's the wanted poster I missed in the tornado section, right up here, above the door. Okay, I got the four wanted posters. I still need to beat Twin Frosty without getting hit. That's gonna be a tough one. We have Bouncy, the Lunk. Well, let's. I'll see you all when I can actually beat Frosty without taking damage. Oh my gosh, I actually did it. Yes! I did it! Oh my gosh. It totally took like, what, two tries to actually do it. Oh, yes! I wanna grab this just because I can. Let's get out of here! Wow! We did it. Beat Twin Frosty without getting hit. Oh, that was so stressful. We got the race car. All that for a race car. Oh my goodness. Hey, we did it. All Waddle Dee saved. When I first did this level, it took me like 10 tries at least because I kept getting hit. Okay, before we end this video off, let's do a couple. Let's do a couple of uh, levels. Let's do Clutter Needle first. Roll up and throw. Clutter Needle Trial. Seems like what we were told to do is, well, throw things. Throw that over there. Throw those over there. <laughs> we can throw those over there. That's kind of cool. I kind of like this mechanic. Where you can just throw things. We can even, like, try to aim them the best way as possible. We can grab those to throw over there. We can grab those to throw over there. I should stop repeating myself. Because it can be. I feel like my commentary can be very annoying of me constantly repeating phrases. Like, there we go. And stuff like that. And whoop. this is fun. I'm glad I chose this one. There is a and one, two, three, drop, and that's it. And done. Rare stone acquired. Oh wow, I I did that super fast. Nice. Wait, let's do one more treasure road and let's head to Waddle Dee Town to get our blueprints taken care of. And I think I want to go do this one. Time crash. Oh, this one's gonna be fun. Let's, let's start up. Let's charge up. And slow everything down. If I put a tie in a bottle, the one thing that I'd like to do is to learn the actual lyrics to the song. Because this song is actually pretty sad. But this, this is my, one of my favorites. This ha has to be like my favorite, uh, uh, my favorite 
Treasure Road because of how amazing it is. Just using the time crash. Ah, oh, that's so, so beautiful. That takes care of the rare stone. And I'm, I believe we have enough t rare stones to, well, deal with the blueprints we collected. Back to Waddle Dee Town, to the Waddle Dee Town. Ooh, I think I know what we unlocked. 181 of these, you say, work together to rebuild, rebuild the game booth. You can now play Tilt and Roll Kirby. The fire ability can now be evolved. And the ice ability can now be evolved. Well, let's get going. I wanna like, we'll do the tilt and roll Kirby later. But first, wow, you have so many blueprints to give me. All right, let me get my tools ready. Uh, then we can get started. Okay, we got that. This is like a repeat of last time. Fire can be evolved. And so can ice. I wanna start with ice. Let's see what we get, what frosty ice looks like. I'm gonna take a wild guess, it will look like... Oh, that's so cute! He wears a little frosty, wild frosty hat. Oh, he even wears a little coat. He's prepared for winter. He's prepared for the winter months. Well, let's evolve fire to dragon fire. We are running low on rare stones, so... We, so Hopefully the, the last of the treasure roads will get us what we want, or what we need, and now... Okay, yeah, that definitely has to... the extra... the extra long chair has to be when we fully evolve, get like our final evolution for an, a weapon, because Dragon's Fire is the final evolution for fire. And finally, like my name, Dragon Kirby exists! It's official! The Dragon Kirby is now real. Fire Kirby. Oh wow, look at this destructive purple flame. And also we could just, I think we just infinitely fly. Wait. One. Oh, come on. We just keep flying, it's awesome. So, I think we're gonna end this video off here. Next time on Kirby and the Forgotten Land, we will, well, finish off the Treasure Roads and Winter Horns and figure out who the Beast King is. I think that's what he's called. I want to double check before I end this up, before I finish my outro. <laughs> because I don't want to, like, you know, make a mistake here. Alright, come on. Why do we have to go all the way back here? No, come on, come on, what is it? The unexpected beast king. Yep. Let's see who this beast king is in the next in the next episode. If you enjoyed this video, you can like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.